Hey guys, welcome to Clockwork Dan to Noodles for something a little bit different. I hope you guys are looking after yourselves and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be playing some 60 seconds. I have seen the game played before so I want to be real with you guys. I've seen people play the game and I've seen quite a few people play the game but I've never played it myself so I'm very excited to give it a shot. Idea of today's game is that we are going to be surviving a nuclear wasteland so we're going to be playing this family you essentially get 60 seconds to gather resources and then survive as long as you can there's going to be different scenarios so i think we're going to have some fun i hope you guys are looking after yourselves it's disgusting outside and i'm wrapped up nice and warm and i'm very excited i am playing with a controller just because i realized that the first 60 seconds are everything so let's begin so we're gonna play the apocalypse mode because i want to scavenge and i really want to survive the apocalypse um who are we gonna play as our lead character you know screw it i'm gonna be dolores let's be dolores and what is the difficulty exploration time is 20 seconds scavenge time is 60 seconds um prepper style holiday oh so you get extra stuff so that's obviously the easy mode that's the middle mode and sar bomber is the hardest mode we're gonna go for the little boy just because i haven't played the game myself and i just want it to be relatively interesting for you guys so we're gonna run join me with the apocalypse so the scenario in this world is russia has hit that nuclear button and we are about to get perished but we are in i think we're an american family we've got a fallout shelter which is really weird this is fun let's just rock and roll i think we're gonna go for it we have 60 seconds but i think we get a little bit of exploration time before the bomb goes off really really nervous i'm hoping the editor wherever you may be i hope you're looking after yourself and you are doing very well i'm gonna make this as interesting as i can and hopefully we're gonna sprinkle in some fine means of the finest setting he is my the editor is my salt bay there we go so why are we spinning i don't know why we're spinning um i don't know why we're spinning can i come in so the timer hasn't gone off yet my why am i spinning i don't know why we're spinning but i will disconnect oh here we go so the fallout shelter is the ah why are we spinning can i just grab you grab you okay i've got my husband fantastic um i am just gonna run sideways why is my why are we spinning? Chuck you in there. I hope you didn't. Enjoy your fall, darling. I need my daughter. Give me my daughter. Give you. What's on the floor? Grab that. Some plain playing cards. I see the water over there. Grab that quickly. I will disconnect my controller once we are in the fallout shelter. So it probably is just my controller is being weird. Timmy, 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 Timmy. Um, just go, just go, just go, just go. Put it in there. We are doing absolutely awful. Just grab a load of stuff. Padlock. Radio. No, 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 no. It's fine. Fine, we've got absolutely nothing. So we're going to do god awful. It's fine. We're going to deal with what we've got. So hopefully we'll get some nice spinning memes or something weird going on. I'm really excited. I, I know we're going to do rubbish because I barely got anything. Um, but normally if your controller isn't spinning around like crazy, you grab as much as you can in that rough 60 seconds. I've got all the people. So we've got all the people. We need to start scavenging ASAP. I don't have the gas mask. So we may have to wait for the radiation to settle. That's a problem. But we're going to deal with it. It's going to be tough. We're going to try not to eat each other. It's going to be the end times, my friend. The end times. Hopefully, Iona is behaving herself. There we go. I've got control again now. So we have a journal. Day number one. So everybody's in the shelter. Fantastic. What did I... Oh, they're giving us some random stuff as well. We've got the Boy Scout manual. We've got some bug spray. And we've got the chess board the boy scout manual is very handy i just wish i had the gas mask that is the problem who's gonna eat today we've only got two and three so we've barely got anything you don't need to eat every single day and today's date 
Confined spaces are not a friendly environment. We very quickly got into an argument over some trivial things. If these keeps on go this keeps on going, we might find ourselves in a very nasty place. So that's it. This is today and I'm just, we survived one day. We basically got down into the shelter. I didn't try to eat each other. Oh my God, my dude, Ted, look at your magnificent, he, he grows a beard eventually as well. I am excited. So today we need someone to go scavenging. Um, problem is you get really sick because of the fallout. So I think you're supposed to not, or if I had the gas mask, I would send him out. I don't have the gas mask. So whoever designed the fallout shelter was a complete genius. We can't really tell if the green stuff dripping in the corner is an included feature. We should probably try doing something about it Whatever brought, uh, with whatever we brought down here. The Boy Scout manual. I, what are you, are you supposed to use this for something? But I don't want to lose the Boy Scout manual. But that could turn really nasty. I, for the first run, let's just try not to die. We'll do that. Um, I can't afford us to go scavenging just yet. And we're on. So what's, what's today? We have we're done fighting, but for how long? Life is hard for all of us right now. Dolores is in a very good mood. We hope we stay this way. There's nothing going on with Ted today apart from his magnificent beard. Mary Jane seems fine today. Hopefully it's going to stay that way. And Timmy! Timmy, Timmy, Timmy. Timmy is fine. Right. So... I don't think we're supposed to do anything just yet. We'll keep an eye on that. Um, I can't afford to risk anybody's life just yet. I think we should use the handbook. I, I built probably the big mistake and we're probably going to lose the handbook. Oh, I love the Geiger counter in the background. I love that. That is fantastic. Okay. So the problem has been solved. There's no leak, no mess. Back to the tiny shelter. Dolores has to drink. Okay, so we're ready to start. So D Ted doesn't drink anything, but he won't last long. Okay, we need to drink. Everyone needs to drink right now. So today, everybody gets some water. Um, should we go outside? I, I don't know. Today we met a bunch of people dressed which look like Halloween doctor outfits. They claim to be a field hospital moving from place to place, attempting to get those hurt by the hazards out of the wasteland. The problem is, some of our supplies got eaten by something that looked like a Sasquatch. They're asking us if we have any spare hydrogen peroxide. I I don't. I'm sorry, I don't have anything. We're we just going to let them drink. I think you have to... I don't have the gas mask. I'm not going to send anyone out, out until the fallout has kind of done its thing. Right. We don't think they were real doctors, but just in case we got rid of them before, they could start charging us for a home visit. Nobody's thirsty anymore. That is brilliant. I don't want you to eat just yet. Ted is in good shape. You're in good shape. Maybe we should start preparing. Um... Let's put the radio on. I think the radio lets you know when the fallout ends. Okay, so let's put the radio on. Rock and roll. This is exciting, guys. I, I like nice, simple games like this. Oh, we survived five days. Go us. Right. Somebody's drawn a penis dog. Whatever. <laughs> what is this? I can't interact with the shelter very much, but, but that's fine. Right. How unfortunate we took the radio with... Oh, how fortunate we took the radio with us. We can probably listen to some music. They still play music out there, don't they? Everything is okay. That's fine. There's nothing new bothering Mary. That's okay. Um, Who's going to go outside? Who can I afford to lose? Because I don't actually think I'm supposed to send someone out this early. Timmy, I'm going to sacrifice you. You are sacrificing. Ha 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 ha. For the blood god! Blood for the blood god! Janne! Righty ho! Okay, Timmy's gone out into the wasteland. We don't know if he's ever going to come back. He probably won't. Denoris needs water. Ted needs water. Ted is also hungry as well. And getting something to drink sounds... Okay, she's also quite hungry. So, we can do, oh, I don't like that. She didn't report being hungry. 
You all needed water though. And because Timmy's not, I like the fact that it, it doesn't use the whole water. Because I think back in the day it, it did. We have plenty of distant relatives, but none of them mean as much as Aunt Ada. She lives in the country, so there's a good chance she's still configuring her cow counting machine. Okay. Moo! Uh, and not worrying about the nukes raining down on her hen house, but too bad we don't have a photo. Um, would the book help? Yeah. Okay. Rock can roll. Let's rock. Hopefully, Timmy doesn't come up to come back too irradiated. Day seven. It has been a week since we all lived inside this tiny little. Oh my god! Her hair. Look, this is my hair on a good day. We did it. The photo we were looking for was stuck between the pages of the scout handbook. What a lucky coincidence. It's a bit blurry, but it's still a wonderful surprise. Dolores hasn't eaten in a while. So today, the only person who's eating is Dolores. And you guys are chill. So the only person is you. There we go. So we found some weird mushrooms growing on the side of the wall. Food shortage is no laughing matter. Maybe it would be a good idea to grab a mushroom bite or two. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, you know that there are some mushrooms out there that can cause liver failure, heart failure. That, 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 mushrooms are scary, guys. As a kid, I know this is really, really sad, I used to look through my mushroom handbook and I would look at how dangerous the mushrooms were because we used to go walking a lot and I really enjoyed just seeing roughly what I could find and knowing that there are some mushrooms out there that look like just normal mushrooms. Uh, it terrified me because there are some mushrooms that look like just normal mushrooms and it can cause internal bleeding and nasty stuff. So I, I'm going to take a risk. Why would I say Why would I say no? Sure. I, I'm glad we're going to go green. I bet someone's going to... Oh, telephone! Nobody looks sick though. Did we eat mushrooms? We learned something today. Tomato soup is our best friend and mushrooms are not. Yuck. I hope nobody got sick from that. Dolores is no longer hungry. There's not much going on with Ted. No trouble. Uh, Meruel is handling. She looks fine apart from her hair. But that's fine. And nobody needs to eat them. Ring, ring. There were... Oh, there we were. Thinking that we'd never hear the telephone signal ever again. When a telephone starts to ring from somewhere outside. Ugh. Oh. That's, I've got no other kids. I'm running out of kids. I'm running out of kids. Day eight. Make contact with other wastelanders. Okay. Rock and roll. Let me agree. There we go. There we go. There we go. I Timmy hasn't been back in a while. Should I be concerned? Have I killed off Timmy? Is Timmy already dead? Right. Timmy isn't back. What happened? We answered the phone and we could clearly hear a gasp of release from, uh, relief from the caller. They introduced themselves as survivors from a nearby town of Hill Valley. We started exchanging information when the line, the call was cut short. Something must have gone ro wrong on their side. We hope they're going to get back soon. Water is all you want. You want water. Uh, water. Right. I know in the game there are three different endings and the survivors is a good one. You want water. What was that sound? A galloping horse? We rushed to the door and we were greeted by two men dressed like they'd come from a medieval fair. Oh, the coconuts. It's like, a, it's like, is it Monty Python? We're having a Monty Python reference. Yes. We identified this source as one of them holding two rocks. Yes. And hidden them against each other constantly whilst they were skipping around. They are the knights that say me. We were pretending to be a rider. They said they were looking for an antique cup. It really is the Holy Grail. But they got lost. We haven't got a map, so we can't help them. Uh, we've made... Yeah, we've made contact. The next one is await further instructions from the friendly wastelanders. I think Timmy's dead. I honestly think we have killed off Timmy already. This has to be the quickest that someone can kill a character. Survive 10 days. Yeah, we've unlocked a... I think... Yeah, so 10 days there. We've got a padlock there. Her hair looks magnificent. She can turn into a mutant. This is a really bad situation um we can't contain our laughter the guests took offense they ran off shouting that their ancestors were Roman. <laughs> oh my god um it was it was it your your mother was a hamster and your father smells like elderberries something like that well that's that is great dolores isn't that's it everybody is good but mary jane is getting hungry i could just feed mary jane that's fine 
We stumbled upon some weird signals when changing the radio frequencies. We're pretty sure that behind the layers of the terrible static and screams, we can hear a voice. Speaking a foreign language. Oh dear, what if it's the Soviets? We should probably listen to it, but what about the children? We've only got one kid left. I think it's fine. Mary Jane can handle it. She's a, she's a big girl. She's fine. Oh! Oh my god! Ah! Timmy! Oh my god, dude! Timmy, did you bring anything? We were relieved to see at first... That, oh, uh, we were relieved at first when we figured out it wasn't the Soviets, but it turns out it's the Canadians, which isn't that much better. <laughs> you could tell they're American. Either way, they're foreigners, and we can't understand what this... What the hell? Not a word. How disappointing. We were so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wastelands and is safe for now. He looks awful. He went on a trip to a more specific place than this time. A local museum with a tra uh, on Tranquility Lane. Several rooms and corridors were decorated with some charred paintings that had survived the blast. Uh, we've got some water. That's, that's good. Uh, Timmy can have some water and a little bit of soup because he's done the hard work. I don't have a med kit, so he's probably going to die. We should start preparing for someone else to go out. Let's put the radio on. Brilliant. What day are we on? What day is it? Day 12. Oh, Morse code. Oh, I love it. I recently went to Bletchley Park yesterday. Uh, well, it won't be yesterday, yesterday when the video goes up, but recently I went to Bletchley Park in the UK. Uh, it, Morse code everywhere. It's where they crack the Enigma machine. So it, I like this. This is so exciting for me. Uh, the, the government has made a broadcast about extracting survivors from our area. They announced that everyone was listening to... Oh, asked everyone to listen to wait for a while. Um, she's not eaten. Thirsty, thirsty. Timmy... Timmy looks pale. Timmy has not... Timmy's looking sick. I've given you food. Can I just give Timmy a little bit of water? Um... Mary Jane can go outside and yeah that's fine I think this has opened up two different endings for us so we are doing very very well yes we're gonna leave it here today at episode number 12 I'm very excited we're gonna send Mary Jane out into the wasteland we're not doing very well because I my controller was spinning around but we are gonna make the do with the best thing we can I'm gonna see how many people we might end up with some luck maybe some people will visit the shelter we'll get some money and stuff but hopefully for now that is everything we need and ah oh, look how cute i am i am so cute hey Iona, say hi she's like no i'm shy i am shy i'm shy oh yeah i'm shy thank you guys so much for tuning in i hope you guys are looking after yourselves thank you everyone for being uh, awesome noodling in the noodle bowl i will see you guys again soon Bye-bye, guys.